All right, what's up, everybody? I'm back here with another IRL mail day. Got one item right here from a guy on Twitter. He was giving away some uh, baseball cards for free. It didn't cost me anything. So um, basically, I uh, I looked to see what Yankee cards he had. There was one. He wasn't the greatest Yankee, but he was still a Yankee. So he kind of counts. So hold on. Sorry about that. So let's get right into this. Let me open this up real quick. Okay. Oops. All right. Sorry, my controller vibrates. I should probably put it somewhere where you guys won't hear it as much. So there it is. Hold up. There we go. There it is, in this. I gotta open it carefully. Word of advice, if you're gonna package cards like this, don't wrap it up in paper, unless it's in like a penny sleeve and a top loader. I don't know if it is or not, I would assume it is. If it is, then that's cool. If not, well, oh well. I believe it is though. No, it's not, it's in a couple. It's like a couple cards in one penny sleeve. Word of advice, make sure you always send your uh, cards in a top loader and a penny sleeve just in case of shipping damage. I learned that throughout my time in collecting, and I just want to make sure that, you know, nobody, you know, bothers you for that. Uh, so, we got, this is the card I got. He threw in a couple extras, very nice. Very nice cards like that to my collection. Well, at least... One of them, because I, I mainly do inserts, but the other ones I'll probably just put with the, the base cards. But the main one I got was this gold Jesus Montero rookie, numbered out of 2012, obviously. I don't know what the numbering is, though. It's right there. 1037 out of 2012, right there. Jesus Montero was a catcher, I believe. Was he a catcher? Yeah, he was. I don't know whatever happened to him, but I'll let you guys know in the description. And then the other one I'm liking that I had never seen before from 2012 Gypsy Queen is this uh, Reggie Jackson Reggie Jackson Moonshots insert. Very cool. I like that. And then the, the other ones that I'm going to just throw in with my base sets are uh, Derek Jeter base. Oh, no, sorry. Nick Swisher base. David Cohn. And Brandon McCarthy. So yeah, so this guy's really cool. Uh, gave these to, gave me that card and then these extras for free. No, you know, nothing cost me. It didn't cost me anything. Fuck, I can't speak. So I really appreciate it. Thanks, my man. Uh, but like I said, yeah, word of advice: always make sure you ship in a, um, a penny sleeve and a top loader. And if you don't have that, try to find something you know that will actually work. I understand, like, not everybody has access to top loaders and penny sleeves, but if you guys want, for my card collector fans out there, I could uh, post some uh, some low-budget things you could do to get, like, penny sleeves and top loaders, or, or how I used to ship cards. If anybody's interested, let me know in the comment section down below, as well as leave a like and subscribe. So that's going to do it for this video, just a short little video. Oh wait, before I go actually, I want to show you guys these. I did open some NBA packs I had. Got three autographs. One from Prestige, or two from Prestige 1718, and then one from uh, 1415 uh, Panini Donruss. So one of the autographs from uh, Prestige, Zach Collins bonus shot. Gonna sleeve that up in a little bit. Very nice auto, sticker. Next one, uh, old school colors, 93 to 04, Jamal, what is it, Mashburn, very nice card, very nice auto, and last but not least is a rookie, uh, excuse me, rookie auto relic of Russ Smith, none of these are numbered from what I checked, I really like that, but yeah, so that's going to do it for this video, um, probably going to stream tomorrow, not too sure. But yeah, so I'll see you guys tomorrow, and I hope you enjoyed this video and this pack opening. And I'm going to make sure I send this guy uh, the video so that he knows that I opened it and got it.
All right. Thanks. Peace out.